Hi everyone, I'm Beth Ham. Um, you might know me as Beth in Texas or B Thin Texas, and this is my weight loss journal. This week I really didn't lose any weight. I still weigh the same as I did last week, and it was a uh, hundred and ninety-six, I believe it was. It were right around that number, real close within a couple ounces. Um and that's what I weighed in at this morning. Uh I don't really have a lot to say this week. I do, well, maybe I do. I keep getting offers. I had gotten an offer to be a spokesperson for some diet plan where you take something for your diet and, and do a rapid weight loss thing. And I turned them down uh, because personally, I don't believe rapid weight loss is a very safe way to go. Um, there are these hormone injections people are doing. It's the newest craze for weight loss. Uh, I forget what it's called. It's got like three initials and I don't remember what it's called because I don't want to. Um, but those are, are hormone injections that they discovered uh, that for infertility, they were giving women these injections for infertility and they were losing weight. And so they decided to try a lower dose of it in weight loss trials and people were losing weight fairly rapidly. I mean, like 10 pounds a week, you know, and that's not the safe way to go. Plus my doctor told me that hormones are part of what promotes breast cancer. So if you have a, have a propensity or you have that genetic inbuilt in you where you can get breast cancer, I know I have family members who had breast cancer, then it's best to stay away from the hormones. And I, I just, I, it scares me the number of people that are trying this and uh, I just hope and pray that they don't end up with cancer or something worse. Um, so yeah, so I'm sticking to the part with don't do anything today to lose weight that you're not gonna be able to do for the rest of your life. And I'm sticking by that and um, because it's the truth. I mean, as soon as you get off, as soon as you stop those hormone injections, you're going to gain the weight back. As soon as you stop taking those diet pills, you're going to gain the weight back and possibly more. And because you used a crutch to lose weight before, it's going to be even harder to lose weight later. Um, think how many years it took you to gain the weight that you gained. That's how long it's going to take for you to lose it. So you got to think about that. Um, so that's the thing. I, I just, please don't send me any suggestions. Don't send me any ideas. I know what I'm trying and I know what's healthy for me to do and what's not. And I know I need to exercise more, which I don't do. Um, there is something I did notice. I made myself a hat. Well, I didn't make it for me. I made it for charity. But I put it on to model it to put on my Ravelry page. And I turned my head sideways and I looked up without smiling. And I noticed this jaw is hanging down. It's like here and here. And my grandmother had those. And it's like, oh no, I'm getting the granny jowls. <laughs> So whenever I do a sideways shot, I have to make sure I'm smiling so it pulls that up. <laughs> so anyway, uh, that's part of the problem. When you get let yourself get fat, when you lose the weight, you're going to have extra skin left over. So that's something you got to face and face reality that I'm not in my 20s anymore. That I am going to be getting wrinkles and sags. So, you know... I don't color my hair anymore. I don't wear makeup very often. It's, I'm going to age gracefully, you know, but that's pretty so much anyway. all it for my weight loss vlog for this week. So I hope that you're doing well. If you fail in any way on your diet, just turn right back around and for your next meal, pay attention to what you're eating just because you have a binge for one moment doesn't mean that you have to drop your diet altogether. You can go back but, on it. Yeah, that's 
that's my weight loss vlog for this week. I know I keep saying that, that and acting like I'm going to end and then I keep talking. So we'll see you next week and have a healthy week. Goodbye.